Let me give you a little tour of how I put my DSLR camera. What I did is uh, I've got this uh, Manfrotto uh, tripod. And most tripods, there's uh, these hex screws that you can take out. And what I did is I put this side on the other side. And uh, I don't know if you can see, I uh, reattached it. See, I took the, these screws out. And then I put it on the other side. So now it's not limited to 360. It can go up. And when I use this in my car, I can do like record my uh, review videos of like Google Maps or something, for example. And it holds it really steady because it's, you know, going up and two legs down. So that's how you do it. Anyway, I just wanted to share that. My little tripod hack for DSLR cameras in your car. So see y'all later. Hi all, this is Max from Xenomax.com. So I'm gonna show you my little camera setup. And see, I'm going to actually drive around and show you uh, that it works pretty well. It's actually a good idea to uh, use it. So, I'm just going to drive around the block. And this is, by the way, my new Klingo, um, Klingo thing. So, this is a great way, if you don't have another person to uh, record your stuff, it's a great way to hack your um, camera. As you can see, I can do... Um, I can record while I'm driving. And my camera is pretty stable. I mean, it's not the best in the world, but I've, you know, you don't have to devise a new way. Um, so that's how I hacked my uh, camera. Um, I just, I'm just showing you this. And then um, I've got to actually, um, I'm going to go around. I'm going to go around. Round. Sorry, there's a bunch of college kids here. Kind of crazy today, but I need to go find my parking spot. I just lost it just to show you this. But uh, this is a great way. Anyway, that's how you uh, hack your camera. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys all later.